Meet Tony. She has a diagnosis of schizophrenia. She has loads of ideas about how her experience of getting support could have been improved. What if I'd been able to help design support services? Well, I'd only have to tell my story once. I'd see the same members of staff every time. I'd feel like every service was working together. And I'd like there to be something better on the TV whilst I wait for my appointments. And now meet Claire, who's Tony's personal assistant. She has an autistic brother and a mother who has depression. She also has a lot of thoughts about the support her loved ones have had and how it could look different. I think they could have done with me when they were training their staff up. Oh, or writing their letters and leaflets. Let's meet Tom. He's a keen and active member of his community. He has a learning disability and he has lots to say about how the people he knows have been supported over the years and what's worked for them and what's not worked. I'll just tell them to listen and to work together with each other. But I think we all probably agree. We could listen better, and we could work together better. And this is why we are introducing the Derby and Derbyshire All Age Mental Health, Neurodiversity and Learning Disability Alliance. So, what do we mean by alliance? Well, to put simply, it's about organisations joined together for everyone's benefit. So as organisations, we are coming together to make things better for the individuals, communities and everyone that works and volunteers to make a difference. We're hoping that by working in a different way, together we can help people feel valued and able to add value. To feel treated with dignity and respect. Feel comfortable and independent while feeling part of our community and feel safe and listened to and in control of their mental and emotional health. And to do this, we've been making time to truly listen to each other and working out how we can do things better for the people of Derby and Derbyshire. It is more than just a meeting. It's about a shared direction and asking questions about how things could be different. And we're finding out we have so much more in common than we ever thought, and gained so much strength from our diversity. So we've shaped our principles around doing things together with one another, shoulder to shoulder, and with our communities, with co-reduction, co-design, co-accountability, and co-responsibility being at the core of how we do things. And to do this, we have come with some agreements about how we all work together. We, as both organisations and individuals, believe strongly that no one person or organisation owns the truth. The wisdom and the power resides in the collective. We are all experts, and our experience and input should be valued equally. We believe we should focus on the group purpose using a strength-based approach. And we all agree to use inclusive communication tools, techniques and methods. And everyone, this includes experts by experience, should have every opportunity to input into settings, priorities, planning, shaping, designing and reviewing services. We genuinely feel that having an alliance that we're all signed up to can help with joint planning, joint delivery, provisions of mutual aid, pooled budgets, developing a shared workforce and career pathways. And as we work as a bigger team that values one another's diversity and is working in the same direction, this should lead to cost benefits and improve staff satisfaction as we're able to spend more time working in ways that really make a difference. And this will be good for our communities as well, with benefits such as improved experience, 
and improve population health. Now this change will take time and will impact on people's lives and help people like Tony, Claire and Tom live their best life, achieve their aspirations and have a better overall quality of life. The Alliance is an open invitation and we'll be releasing information on how to join soon. And we'd love you and your organisations to be part of this journey.